Yes, guys, how is it going? Welcome back to the adventure. Today, it's a huge one. I don't care what anyone says. I am more nervous for Brighton at home than I was for Liverpool and Atletico Madrid last week. We're playing Brighton today. Obviously, they're coming off the back of an amazing week. They beat Arsenal at the Emirates and Tottenham at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. We can never beat Tottenham at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium, so I'm <laughs> quite concerned about Brighton. They're in good form. They're currently sitting about 10th in the league actually they're doing really really well and actually the last time we played them we were fourth and they were third so it always is quite a big game this year we've got to win Liverpool won last night by four goals nil against the red half of Manchester so we have got to win it's a massive game for us time to get to the Etihad Stadium get behind the guys for tonight's game come on City let's do it let's get back to the top of the league Okay, we've made it into the Etihad Stadium for tonight's crunch match, I think, between City and Brighton. Obviously, Brighton coming off the back of two amazing wins in North London at the home of Spurs and Arsenal. Uh, City, obviously, we've got to the Champions League semis. Brilliant. Uh, a draw against here in Liverpool in the league. Could have been a win. I still stand by it. We probably should have won. And then, obviously, the disappointing first half and defeat in the semi-final in the FA Cup. Uh, e is actually having a nightmare. They're the network that I'm with. And it's not working. So I apologise in advance if I can't get the vlog out as fast. And also, I have no idea what the teams are. So I'm going to go down and we're going to see who's warming up because there's no other way for me to say uh, who the teams are because I can't even get 40. Anyway, time to get in for today's big match. Come on, City, let's do it. Big, big win needed. And where are shot? And the big We need to win this. City! Must win. Let's go. Oh. Hit that. Oh. I could have gone in. Send him. Here we go. Good ball. Oh. Lack of communication there. Very okay. Oh. Oh. I can't get his head to it again. Defending that for Kukurea. Such a really good touch. Yeah. Uh, the ball was a bit socking. Can't tell. Get that cross in. That's it. Off. Oh. Unlucky. I mean, it's been a bit of a flat start. I know I'm not never going to compare City to Liverpool. Two different play styles, but Liverpool already a goal up by this time at United, and usually here we're a goal up with inside five minutes so it's been a bit of a slow start Brighton remaining compact and well shaped and organised it's going to be difficult I did say this come on oh come on Bernardo needs to get it on his left ah uh, Good. I mean, it's still a little bit flat. I mean, very flat in the midfield. We just slow it up. Under one to Foden, and then we just go back. It's just looking slow. Still nil nil. No real good chances, to be fair. Cancelo just had a long shot. Very far out. Very, very long way over. Still nil nil. Come on! Come on, Kevin! Yes! Oh, it's a great tackle. It's just a bit slow. One extra pass. Goal! Best chance of the game. Finally a good move. Come on, City! Better! Come on, Riyad! Oh, Bernardo! Someone! Oh! Fingertips! Come on! Take him on! It's a good save. Come on, City! We are getting closer. Oh, yes. Go on, Ria. Oh. No. Oh. That's a challenge. It's probably twice, actually. Oh. The ball's going to get that. Oh, what are you doing? He's a battler, Lancey. He's giving it a right go. I'm surprised that's not a foul. 
No, I think that's a foul. I think Brighton are unlucky there. Got Bernardo. He's going to get in the box for him. Come on. Oh. Brighton, so well organised, to be fair. That's a better cross. Oh, that's a great ball in that. Come on, still got it. Let's create something here. Kukurella is playing brilliantly. He's reading now, it's like a book. Come on, let's keep it going. Oh, good save. Good head. No one. Come on. Take him on, just take him on. But before I do my section, I'm a bit hungry today, so I decided to get a sausage roll, which is quite hard to do with one hand, so I'm going to give it a little taste test. It's not bad. It's not bad. I hate pork in my mouth, full, but it's a lot to swallow. It's not bad. Okay, now, now we've got that out of the way, it's time for the half time review, and it's not really a lot to report. Kevin De Bruyne has hit the target twice, but at the same both times. Now, right and look quite dangerous in the midfield, uh, especially I think Kukurella is defending Real Maris really well. Lamptey is the most dangerous player for Brighton, he's getting up a lot and he's always battling uh, against Nathan Ake and he can feel that he can take on uh, the Dutch fullback who is filling in at fullback obviously uh, with you no know, Kyle Walker so Kinsella's had to go to the right. It's a little bit of a weird half but it is 0-0 and we need to get a goal. I don't want to be waiting until the 90th minute. It's got to be a win today. There is no other option. Liverpool, uh, we're close to gap to one. One, of, one point of us ahead. I'm just a bit nervous. We're not playing great. Brighton are defending well. It's 0 0 at half time. Oh, great in the first man. Hit that. Oh, not so far. It's going to be a corner. Oh. What a vital deflection that is, if it isn't, well, it is a corner, but Rodri can't believe it. Oh, oh third the worst. Come on, Ken. Oh! Yeah! Big goal! Come on! Come on! Get in! Come on! Get in! Huge goal! Oh, what a massive goal that is and sometimes you need a little bit of that luck and we got it, it just rebounded, brilliant run from De Bruyne, we got a little kick in on the way around, Mahrez got that little bit of luck, finished it off brilliantly, great goal, oh, big goal. Come on, we have with the Tuckers, oh, Foden with the running over the ball. Oh, Stonesy, Stonesy, <laughs> lucky. Oh, well, he tried getting around two of them. He, he is quality, but it's not messy. Shoot. It's deflected, yes! Come on! There's the goal. Come on! Oh, yes! Bill Foden is one of our own. Big goal. No, it's a big second goal and sometimes you can play not great and get a result and that's what we're doing tonight. I, hope, I think only City and Liverpool actually do that to be fair. Big, big goal, deflected, shot from Foden, 2 down. good. Yes! Oh, surely! Oh, what a block. Come on, Bale, good save. Yes! Oh, what a block. Now the fight goes up. Well, Stones has been Magnificent tonight, but is this an injury? I'm not too sure. Zinchenko's coming on. I'm hoping it's not an injury because obviously with Walker out, Diaz just coming back, Ake's gone off injured. 
We're struggling at the back, but hopefully it's all right. Good to see Zinni coming on. Get in. And there we go, we have got number three, and it, it's a little bit of a crazy goal, it's given away from the batting goalkeeper, and Bernardo Silva for this game, big, big third goal, we haven't played best, but we've been good in the second half, it's the response that we needed, the response that I asked for at half time, it was the lucky sausage roll guys, trust in the sausage roll, anyway, it is three now, big, big, three points, three goals, three points, smile on my face. Kevin comes on. He's got himself 80 minutes. Oh, get this, the boy! Oh, good shot. Oh. Uh, too much uh, play in the tight play in the box. Oh. Well, that was bad. That's just summed up Brighton in the second half. But we're good in the first. We'll take it. Come on. Cantalos on floor. Big win, big win. Back to the top. So we can stay there. So there we go. It's finished at the SM Stadium. Not a bit of a bowl like that. It is finished. 3-0. Uh, we didn't play well, especially in that first half. But we managed to get a result. We were good in the second. Not brilliant. Not City brilliant. But we were good enough to be Brighton. And I thought Brighton were really, really good in the first half. They were stubborn, they were well organised and disciplined. And they really frustrated City. But I thought Riyad Mahrez was excellent in the second half. A brilliant run for Kevin De Bruyne. Great in the first half. We got the first goal. But a little bit of luck. He rebounded to Mahrez, but he finished it well. Phil Foden deflected shot. Grabbed a bit of a bit of a lucky second as well. But we needed that bit of luck tonight. It was only going to come uh, through either an absolute killer pass, a little bit of longer a set piece. We got it. Very, very happy. And a mistake from Brighton. Got that third goal from Bernardo Silva, who was excellent. Uh, so, yeah, we're back at the top. That's all that matters. I was nervous about today. Brighton had a great run of form coming in. And also a massive, massive shout out to the guys that have come up from Brighton. I was going to say down from Brighton. You can't go down to Brighton or you'll be in France. But up from Brighton. Uh, long, long, long way to go on a Wednesday night. A working Wednesday night as well. So, safe journey to all the Seagull fans heading back to the home. Yeah, big, big win. Uh, very, very happy. Come on. Big shout out also to the Brighton fans that have come up. It is a long way to come on a Wednesday night. Fair play to us. So that is going to bring an end to the vlog. If you have enjoyed it, make sure to smash the like, subscribe down below. I'm already giving you apologies. It may be a bit late getting out. One of the cell towers has gone down at City. So I usually edit my first half at half time. Haven't been able to even start on the editing. So I do apologise if this comes out a little bit later than normal. City back at the top and that puts a smile on my face. Peace out from the Etihad and I'll see you guys on Saturday for City versus Watford.